Today's topic is scareware. Scareware is a type of scam that's becoming more and more popular every day. So what happens, you're browsing the internet, minding your own business, then a large pop-up is gonna come up. It's gonna be a full window. That window is gonna have bright colors, maybe flashing. There could be sound playing over your speakers telling you that all your data is gonna be compromised. Your credit card numbers are getting stolen right now. And then there's gonna be a big phone number there. Please call our text at this number to get this resolved immediately. Usually it's gonna to claim to be Microsoft or some kind of antivirus company. These windows are notoriously difficult to get closed. If you call the number, you're gonna be connected to a technician claiming to be from that same company. What they're going to do is talk to you on the phone, try to get a remote connection to your computer so that they can be in control. Then they're going to run some fake scans on your computer. These always turn up at least a hundred things wrong. Then they're going to promise to take care of all these issues for a fee, usually two to six hundred dollars on your credit or debit card. So what should you do? Well, first off, I want to say by anybody who has been targeted by this scam, if you've paid the scammers, you can still contact your bank or credit card provider and get those charges reversed because they didn't do anything for you. So what should you do? If this happens, the first thing I want you to do is take a deep breath. Odds are pretty good and your computer's not stolen, your credit card data is not going to be getting used and nothing's getting deleted. Look around for an X or some way to close that window. Usually they leave some kind of exit so that you can connect to them remotely so they can do the sale to you. If you can't find a way out, try to restart your computer. Generally, one restart will take care of it. If not, you may need to try a second time. If you're still having the same problem with it coming up, you may need to contact the technician to get it taken care of. Remember, if this happens to you, stay calm. That's all I've got for Tech Tips this week. If you want any more information, check out the blog.